I was exposed to cinema when I was very very young. I was exposed to cinema and stories when I was about five or six years old. I like stories in any format. I like it in whether it's animated and told, whether it's uh, told in the comic book, whether it's told as an illustration, whether it's told as a movie, whether it's told as a book. I'd like to uh, continue acting, I'd like to produce, I'd like to write, I'd like to direct. This is uh, the ocean and I'd like to do many, many things in this. So this is uh, my home, this is where I live and this is where I love coming back to. So here you go, welcome to my den. This is an area that I hang out the most in. It's a large space where I do a lot of different things and I'm going to take you to each corner. So that's my solitude corner where I sit and read. Now over to your left is where I watch all my films. This is the bar, this is where friends are, that's where discussions about movies happen. This is a corner of my den where uh, I spend most of my alone time. Welcome to the bar. This is uh, usually where I socialize. There are a lot of friends, people from work, all of us. Now, I live with my family. My father is a big football fan and travels across the world. So everyone who goes around the planet brings something back for this area. Yes, I also have a little hobby. I started cutting bottles. A bottle that's cut into half, I use string and fire to do it. I just make use of it post. I mean, you could use it as a glass, you could use it as stuff to hold something in it. This is quite a cool funky thing that I have, uh, which the first time this came to my house, no one knew what it really was. People assumed it was a speaker, they didn't thought it was a piece of fancy, futuristic looking furniture. But it's quite simple, it's, it's a chair, and it just takes your shape as and when you fall on it and it's pretty vertical and cool. That's something that I like very much and everyone's liked it. This space is where I watch every single film that I can get to see. I, there are times that I spent the entire day here. Most of my meals have been sitting here, film after film, marathons, uh, sessions of watching movies, of watching TV shows. And all this right here, I think you should come and watch it with me. I can watch a film anywhere in the world, but watching it sitting on this couch is far more different than uh, sitting anywhere else. Well, this is uh, where I spend most of my working, non-shooting life and uh, my office room. So the entire wall is usually filled with, uh, with film posters, with memorabilia, with things that inspire me and things that I've liked growing up. This is uh, probably one of the coolest characters in cinema ever, the Joker written. And here you go, this is a pictorial depiction of this, which I thought was very cool and fancy. This shelf right here is, is a good example of how scattered my brain is. I like a bunch of things. There's uh, there's two versions of the Mahabharata. There is uh, there's Gotham comics. I have a copy of the Rig Veda here, and the Upanishads here as well, and uh, and yeah, and a lot of film books. Being an actor was not really a, a discovery or the first path. It is one of the many things that I'd like to do in storytelling. With lives like us, we spend a lot of time away from home. And the minute you come back, there are things that belong to you, very, very essential. Here we go, an old-fashioned picture. 
so that everyone has their own space, uh, yet we're together, yet it's private. So it's a lovely, lovely way of living. And I don't know any other way though. This is the reason the house has been built here. This is the reason uh, why the house is shaped the way it's structured. So the idea is, so for all of us who live here, we get a part of this, uh, this beautiful view and at different levels. I'm one of the few blessed ones in this generation who gets to, who got to live with my grandfather, got to live with my grandparents. I live with my parents, my siblings, and all of us under one roof. Everything that I've done in my life is influenced by my grandfather. Rana comes from Ramanaito. It's the first two initials of uh, each of his names, and, and here you go. I consider myself very, very lucky in terms of being able to live this way. So I guess this is my ground. This is where I, am, I belong to. But I also like, so I can't do that. So, that's just my personality. You want to see him? That's Zach. Say hello to. That's he's greeting you. 